question, who do you reckon is pivotal? Yeah, Aidan Dzeko. He's a real handful up front, Peter, and not just because of his height and that physical presence. He's got excellent awareness and, and technique, and that allows him to bring others into the game. He's a very powerful finisher, too, so he'll be giving defenders a real dilemma about whether to close him down or not. I would advise the former. Yes, he's certainly the one who carries the hopes of his team. So it's away we go then. Jim, which player is best equipped for this game? Yeah, Aidan Dzeko. He's a real handful up front, Peter, and not just because of his height and that physical presence. He's got excellent awareness and, and technique, and that allows him to bring others into the game. He's a very powerful finisher, too, so he'll be giving defenders a real dilemma about whether to close him down or not. I would advise the former. Yeah, the easiest way to make a difference is to score, so no argument there. Tries to get it forward quickly. Chance to break. It's broken loose. Lovely bit of skill there. He's got options in the box if he... Checo hits it! And oh! oh! He's caught in there, it's a free kick. Gets it upfield. Iceland get it back again. Ball's loose. Who's getting there? Checo. Hoists it forward. A chance! Last ditch defending, but that'll do. You can get that clear. That is terrific skill. And it's Besic. Lobs it in gently. Chance! Oh, he's managed to get it all wrong. It was such a clever idea to lift it into his path. Iceland have pushed both fullbacks into quite advanced positions here. Yeah, that's that's interesting. So what are they attempting to do? Well, it's it's a bold attempt, in my opinion, to occupy the opposition in a way they're not expecting. He's looked long this time. <laughs> Battles to win it back. No change to the score, nil-nil it remains. And here's Dzeko, oh, real tries a shot! Goal! Bosnia had to Bovina. Oh, what a cracking goal, but a cracking touch as well. That's what made it for me. That's brilliant play all round. Bosnia and Herzegovina take the lead, 1-0. Yeah, this is also a chance to see what happens to their level of concentration from here. Magnussen. And that's a throw.
Bosnia and Herzegovina are very much in charge here, dominating possession. That a foul? Yes, the uh, referee's given it. Bessic, and he has been fouled there. Well, it was deliberate, it was cynical, and you have to understand the frustration of, of being denied a clear opportunity, but it had to be done. He's gone for it! It's in! Very much like an own goal. Oh, it's an unusual turn of events, and it was an honest attempt to help out, and I suppose it can happen to anyone. Fortuitous as it may have been, they all count one. Forward it goes. And it's Sig Torsen. It could be... Has a hit! Oh, that's a fine save! Well, as Tesco, Peter, the keeper has just received an A-plus grade. Gunnarsson with the short one. He's making good use of his strength there, just refuses to be out-muscled. <laughs> Bosnia and Herzegovina have scored two quick goals here and are well and truly in the driving seat. in a foot to win it back and it's played forward it's got through to him and the keepers in command Bosnia and Herzegovina are in control here on the brink of half time Magnussen, and a header! Oh, just couldn't turn it in. I have to commend the wing plate, but I have to condemn the defending. They've got to stop the cross. To throw in. Good challenge, he just stood firm. It is quite a run he's making here. Oh, nice touch. Besic. Lovely bit of skill. Played back in, out to the left it goes, up to meet it! Good delivery, but no joy. Well, being able to generate that amount of activity in the box means it's hard not to pick someone out.
final action of the first half? Well, it's hard to say whether a two-goal advantage under these circumstances is decisive or not, but so far, I haven't really seen it. Here we go again, then. Magnussen. Besic. Hoists it forward. Tries to dink it in. Steered out wide, but he won't reach that one. to get it forward quickly just brushed off the ball there and it's played forward and the counter is on plays a clever pass he's had a go well he should have done better and he knows it that's a little unfortunate he had a lot of people worried then Magnussen brings it over to the other flank. Deftly done. Get shapes to shoot! Oh, good effort, he got plenty on that. Ah, oh, that's a great effort. There was very little backlift to indicate what was coming. And it's Jekko. Plays it out to the flank. Now it's Jekko. Now the counter. He goes long. And it's got through. Yeah, he's fouled him there. Well, that looks like a final warning. Still no card. Great leap! This could fall anywhere! And that has been clubbed away. Magnussen. And here's Sigtors. It's Sigtorsen! it out to the wing.
steered in. And that's been levered clear. Iceland have it back and they can go again. Aimed in towards the centre. And the defence can get it clear. Well, that looks a foul. Yep, referee's given it. Now it's Dzeko. Oh, sweet feet. Looking for a decent ball in. Big chance! Whistle's gone, that's a foul. Iceland have a free kick. And here's Sig Torsen. Oh, good take in a good area. Ahead by two and just about into the home straight. And there's a long ball. Come back to the keeper. The keeper's got good distance on that. Well, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Oh, that just required a bit more oomph to reach its target. Magnussen. Defending was strong and firm. Besic. Confirmation that there will be two minutes stoppage time. Balls out on the left now. A good challenge, stood up well against his man. But there's going to be another change here. I think this is going to add an entirely different dimension to their attack now. They've got the physical presence, they've got a real aerial threat, and uh, it looks more promising from here. Danger averted for now. A couple of changes then in quick succession. Well, he's worked so hard for his side. Uh, as you would expect, but he couldn't help notice that he was starting to to labor a bit. So it's no surprise Here it comes repelled by the keeper And there goes the final whistle and the manager heads down the tunnel swathed in satisfaction and His team have carried out his instructions to the word and they have got their win How would you sum up what we've witnessed Jim? I enjoyed that, Peter. Both teams went about their work in a, a really committed manner, and for me, it just always held an interest. So just try.